On this video, I'll be showing you how to fix the screen timer or sleep issues on your ROG Ally. I have upgraded this SSD to a 2 terabyte 2280 M.2 and I've recently done a clean and install of Windows 11. And I find that my screen timer or my device doesn't turn itself off, it doesn't go into sleep or hibernation mode. And what you have to do is just check your settings so we just need to go on to our settings options, click on system, click on power and battery. Now when you select screen and sleep, it probably has already automatically set a timer, but if it hasn't, then make sure your settings are set to whatever time or how long you ever need for the device to turn itself off. This was already set up. I did change the the minutes on here to check your lock screen settings so if you go onto the search engine and then what you do is click on screen saver so this is another way if your screen doesn't time itself out you can actually set a screen saver so you can actually do a blank just a dark screen and set whatever minutes you want it to um, go onto the lock screen. I mean, it's not a proper way of putting the device into hibernation or sleep mode, but this is one way of going around it if your device still doesn't work with the sleep and power options. All right, so once that's all checked off, go ahead and go back on search bar, type in control panel. From here, we want to click on hardware and sound choose power options now I've had to do this for each profile here or selected plan so I'm on turbo mode at the moment I'm clicking on change plan settings and again this is just showing me when this is device is going to go to sleep and then click on change advanced power settings over here we just want to expand sleep and then change this value to your desired minutes and then choose display under here expand the display options and I've chosen to turn the display off after three minutes and plugged in 10 minutes so once you're happy with whatever settings you've chosen just click save changes and now we just need to do the same for each profile because they're going to have different values so for some reason that's 180 minutes now under silent mode so just change all of these uh, profiles all right, so the last thing we're going to do is check our Armory Crate settings. So just click on the Armory Crate button. Go on to Settings. Choose Operating Mode. And then go down to Eco Assist. So this has some options here. This will basically bypass the Windows 11 um, settings. So if your Windows 11 fails to go to sleep or save on the battery then the armory crate will override the windows 11 settings and i have extreme standby mode on which basically prolongs your battery life and i also have modern standby assistant on so this will make my uh, rog ally go into hibernation instead of sleep if my device doesn't go to sleep and this won't save as much battery as sleep mode but it will help me resume my gameplay much quicker than having to load up one of Windows again. So hibernation mode does have its benefits. Um, so apart from that, that is uh, that is how you kind of fix sort of this buggy Windows 11 power settings. There's, there's too many of them. I hope this tutorial has been useful. If you do have any comments, then please comment down below. So thanks for watching. And I'll see you again on another video.